Don't fight me, because I know how you girls love to tussle. What's up, Court Crew, and welcome back to the channel. It's your girl, Courtney Janine, and I'm back with another video. Today, as you can see, I'm super excited because I'm starting a new series on my channel called was it popular or did we actually like it? I got this idea from Jackie Ina here on YouTube. She does it with makeup products or skincare products, but today I'm gonna be doing with it with synthetic wigs because you guys know I love synthetic wigs. So I'm gonna be revisiting or just trying a unit for the first time that's older, that had a lot of hype around it. And I'm gonna put it to the test. Like, are we still checking for her? Like, does she still give or is it not given what it's supposed to give? So, let me know down in the comments because I picked out this unit, um, but I want to hear from you all. What is a unit that you felt like got all the hype and you want to put it to the test? Because this is actually one. I feel like this whole collection, we'll get into it. Or you saw it in the title. So we'll get into that. But I feel like there's other units that I want to try. So let me know down in the comments. I feel like Kamaya was one. I'll try Kamaya. Um... Alche Kamalia, but like those units are newer, so I would like to get a little bit older, like 2019, you know, those type of units. So, comment down below if you have a wig suggestion. Today's video, um, this wig was sent to me from Sam's Beauty, so you know I gotta shout them out. Thank you so much, Sam's Beauty, for sending me today's unit. They also sent me over two other products that I want to highlight today, which is the Bye Bye Lace Grid. It comes in two colors, so I made sure to pick them both out so I can show you all the different. It is basically a lace wig grid and not eraser. So I want to put it to the test, see if it's given what it's supposed to give. See what it's supposed to give. Um, it comes in two colors, which is HD natural and HD clear. So we're going to be testing this out today. But I didn't even tell you all what wig we are um, featuring today. And that is Nisha Soft and Natural Lace Front Wig in the style Nisha 201. And I got it in the color DRFF Honey Brown. This wig took over like i'm not even going front this was when i had just started getting back into youtube i believe it was january 2020 because i remember i took a trip to new york and i brought i didn't bring this wig i brought 202 and 203 with me and this one was all the rave because of the color the honey brown color so i made sure to pick it up in that color um so i'm excited to try this one because i've never tried this one i remember i felt like the niches were a little bit overhyped don't fight me because I know how you girls love to tussle. By the way, um, I have a question. And don't fight me because I know how you girls like to tussle. <laughs> but I felt like this was a little bit overhyped. So we'll see. Now that it's been a couple years, you know, I'm more of a, an experienced wig reviewer. So let's get into it. So yeah, before we get into this video though, if this is your first time seeing me here on the YT, hi, my name is Courtney Janine. I do a lot of beauty, fashion, and lifestyle content here on this channel. So if you like any of those topics, subscribe, join the Court Crew family down below. It's lit over here. Okay, and let's get into it. So like I said, today's unit is Nisha Salt and Natural Lace Front Wig in the style. 201 so this is what she looks like i got her in the stock card color which is drff honey brown and i picked out that color because i felt like that was the one that had like the most recognition the one that was hyped you know so let's go ahead and open this up unbox her see what she is giving i feel like it's been a minute since i had a nisha wig in general so i'm definitely going to be Cutting off the stock card and discussing the key points. So, okay, key features are high heat resistant fiber, natural texture and volume, pre plugged HD transparent lace, and easy to wear styles. I'm feeling the color, I'm not even gonna lie. And I like the style, it's very natural. Not sure about this lace though, we might have to pluck a little bit, but I love the style, I love the color, I love the color. It's giving Beyonce color. Thank you. My name is Beyonce. Beyonce? Mm-hmm. Oh. Mr. One, let me see you run. Yes, oh, that's me. That's, you. that's me. Okay, you guys. So, this is it straight out the pack. I'm going to go do my makeup, and then I'll be back to install her. And we will be testing out the new Bye Bye Lace Grid, so stay tuned. All right, you all. So, I am back. Makeup is done, and we are ready to start installing this unit like i mentioned before we are going to be applying the bye bye lace grid and not eraser so 
Um, Sam's Beauty actually gave me a little hint because you guys know when you're testing out new products It's best to know how to apply it and they did tell me that like this is a not eraser It doesn't mean that it's going to like be your color. You know what I'm saying? So you have to like tint your lace before applying this and what I did was I used the even tinted lace spray light warm brown I tried to go in with my powder, but um, it just seemed like the spray was easier today and this is I'm going to just open this one because this is HD natural it has like a little color to it it's still kind of flesh color but there is a bit of color to it while this color which is HD clear it's in the name it's literally clear so I'm not sure which color I will be using today um, I'm just going to cut a small so you guys can kind of see what it does um hmm. let's try out clear i'm not sure about this and it's very sticky it's very easy to take off as well which i do like like that's really nice i'm gonna cut a smaller piece because i think that piece that i had for the hd natural was a little too long for the part hope it's focusing but you can like barely see it which is what i like so we're gonna leave that one on the lighting always goes in and out with this. Okay, so I'm putting the wig on. Oh, I, I'm obsessed with this color. Like, I don't think you understand. I'm obsessed. Okay, so in terms of like which color I like more, I definitely really do like the clear a little bit better than the natural. It kind of gives me the effect of like this faux scalp <laughs> in a sense. But anyways, let me go ahead and lay this unit down and we will be back. So here's the final look of Miss Nisha 201 and I have some thoughts. So let's go ahead and get into it, chow. Before we get into the unit, let's talk about the Bye Bye Lace Grid, Lace Wig Grids and Not Eraser. I really did like the clear. Um, you honestly do not need a lot. You literally just need enough to cover the part or the frontal that you're doing. And it's a look like i feel like it's giving um faux scalp so take that as you will i feel like some people like the faux scalp some people don't this is great though because you can just apply it straight to the part i think it did help a little bit but like sam's beauty mentioned to me and i'm telling you guys i'm an expert now when you're using this you only like you still need to tint the lace it's not like a replacement of tinting the lace it is more so erasing the knots not so much giving it color especially since i went in with the clear even the hd natural is a bit transparent too it just has a little bit of color but it's not you still need to tint your lace so that's that on that okay let's get into this unit and my thoughts was it popular or is it actually good i think this is actually good i love the color i'm obsessed i'm wondering okay how many more units can I get in this honey brown color? This might be one of my favorite color blends. I don't know who it is kicking off the list, but this is definitely up there. It's giving Beyonce, it's giving auntie, but also very realistic and natural, which is why I love Beyonce's hair color so much because it is a blonde, but it looks so natural. Like it always looks like it's, that's her hair color. Like why are we even questioning it? She's a natural blonde, are you dumb? <laughs> 
so yeah i feel like that in this unit um i love the texture of nisha's which is kind of like the selling point i love the curly texture i mean not the curly i love the kinky straight texture that soft yakky feel i love the style it's very like an everyday type of unit the color sold me what else would i say i will say with the lace pre-pluckness has definitely evolved especially since the melted hairline collection like this was not pre-plugged and it's not enough lace even to pluck it more so that's that but all in all i really do like this unit i think that it wasn't just popular i think we actually like this unit so let me know down below other units that you would like me to try or revisit um in this series and thank you guys for watching thank you again to sam's beauty for sending me this unit and i'll see you guys in my next one bye guys guys we used to roll at the ring we used to roll at the ring